A civil engineer is a person who practices civil engineering, the application of planning, designing, constructing, maintaining, and operating infrastructure while protecting the public and environmental health, as well as improving existing infrastructure that may have been neglected. Civil engineer is one of the many careers that contribute to society. However, there are still many people who still do not understand the role of civil engineer. This video was made to explain more clearly the role of engineer. Hopefully at the end of this video you gain knowledge and better understand the role of engineer. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and greetings. I am Abizarin Habibullah bin Aini, degree in civil engineering, UTHM student. I am gonna show and explain to you one of the most critical role of civil engineer on construction projects. That is detailing, designing, and drawing using computer software design such as AutoCAD. Step Pro, Revit, and SketchUp. Construction design is the realization of a concept, idea, or theory into a drawing, plan, specification, or a model that will satisfy requirements of aesthetics, budget, structure, regulations, climate, and so on depending on a project. That is all from me. I give you the next presenter. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Adilia Izati, DF 2008-1. Okay, today I'm going to explain about civil engineering. Okay, civil engineers have to make sure that the projects complies with legal requirements, especially for health and also safety. Okay, why is it so important to observe health and safety? measure in a project okay first it helps the company becomes more effective to finish the project on time and then to improve their business profile with customer and clients okay the main health and safety regulation in construction is construction design and management regulation 2015 and also control of substances hazardous to health regulation which uh, known as COSHH 2002. Okay, this is important uh, for the use of manufacturer's maintenance instruction as a guide. Okay, that's all for me. Thank you. Hi, my name is Ideal. My metric number is DF20051. I would like to present about the role of civil engineers in terms of engineering the project to run smoothly and completed within the budget. Managing a project includes identifying your project requirement and writing down that everyone needs from the project. When everyone understands the goal, it much easier to keep them all on the right path. Make sure set our goal that everyone agrees on to avoid team conflicts later on. Understanding and addressing the needs of everyone affected by the project means the end result of the project far more likely to satisfy your stakeholders. For the budget, project managers have to balance between not running out of money and not underspending because many projects receive funds or grants that have contract clause with a use it or lose it approach to project funds. With all these characteristics are important because large part of project is dedicated to ensuring the project is completed at the appointed time. That's all from me. Thank you. Assalamualaikum. To our lecturer, my name is Ikma. Number metric 200-128 would like to present about the role of civil engineers in terms of technical and feasibility studies. Feasibility studies are preliminary studies undertaken in the very early age of a project. They tend to be carried out when a project is large or complex, or when there is some doubt or controversy regarding the proposed development. If an environmental impact assessment EIA, is required, this may involve assessment best undertaken as part of feasibility studies. The purpose of feasibility studies is to first establish whether the project is viable, to help identify feasibility option and to assist in the development of other project documentation such as business case, project execution plan and also strategic brief. I think that is all from me. Thank you very much. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Amir Shaji Kuitros and I am Nomometric AF 180122. Solving design and development problem is one of the role of civil engineers. 
By solving a design and a development problem, it can solve a common problem in nature such as a float, landslide, and so on. This can indirectly provide a better life to the community. Engineers use the engineering design process when a brainstorming solution to real life problem. They develop this solution by testing and redesigning prototype that work within a given constraint. And that's all for me. Thank you. Transportation has always been essential in the evolution of society. Civil engineer will play a significant essential part in the evolution of our transportation system, whether it is through the reconstruction of existing highways or the creation of faster, more sustainable modes of transportation in the future. Assalamualaikum and a very good day. My name is Nur Aisha Ramiti and I will present about the roles of civil engineers in transportation network. Civil engineers must be prepared to thoroughly test plans for safety and practicality since they are responsible for the safety and efficiency of roadways. Roundabouts, for example, come in a variety of shapes and sizes, with many of them providing similar levels of safety while also requiring drivers to learn how to use them. In essence, a civil engineer's role in the field of transportation engineering is to use system for societal needs, securely and efficiently transport people and material from one location to another. A civil engineer plans builds and maintains various sorts of transportation infrastructure, such as airports and highways.